Chapter 6 Knowing Visual Basic 2008 Important Points 1. Introduction 2. Visual Basic 2008 Integrated Development Environment 3. Creating VB Calculator 4. Working with Controls 5. Commonly Used Controls 6. Place Controls on the Form Dear Friends, Today I will introduce a programming language to you named Visual Basic 2008. It was introduced by the Microsoft. It is an easy language that can be learned easily. It not only allows us to create simple GUI applications but also helps us to develop complex applications. Let us know more about this language. Introduction Visual Basic 2008 is the latest version of Visual Basic launched by Microsoft in the year 2008. It is almost similar to Visual Basic 2005, but it has many new features added. Visual Basic has gone through many phases of development since the days of BASIC that was built for DOS. BASIC stands for Beginners All-Purpose Symbolic Instruction Code. The program code in Visual Basic resembles the English language. Different software companies had produced many different versions of BASIC for DOS such as Microsoft QBASIC, QuickBASIC, GW Basic, and IBM BASIC and more. Visual BASIC is GUI based and especially developed for MS Window. Since then the DOS versions of BASIC were slowly phased out and almost completely replaced by Visual BASIC. Visual BASIC 2008 is a full-fledged object-oriented programming OOP language. So, it has caught up with other OOP languages such as C++, Java, C Hash and others. Visual Basic 2008 Integrated Development Environment When you launch VB 2008 Express, the integrated development environment will be presented to you as shown in figure below. Recent Projects Pain Getting Started Pain The VB Express Headlines Pain The IDE consists of a few pains, namely The Recent Projects Pain It shows the list of projects that have been created by you recently. The Getting Started Pain It provides some helpful tips to quickly develop your applications. The VB Express Headlines Pain It provides the latest online news about Visual Basic 2008 Express. It will announce new releases and updates. To start creating your first application, you need to click on File in the menu bar and select New Project. The VB 2008 New Project dialog box will appear as shown. The dialog box offers you 5 types of projects that you can create. As we are going to create a Windows application, we will select Windows Form Application. At the bottom of this dialog box, you can change the default project name Windows Application 1 to some other name you like, for example, My First VB Program. After you have renamed the project, click OK to continue. Windows Forms Application Template Project Name the VB2008 IDE with the new form will appear as shown in the figure. It consists of an empty form, the common controls toolbox, the solution explorer and the properties window. Common controls toolbox, new form, solution explorer, properties window, creating VB calculator. Now let's create VB calculator. First of all, drag one common button into the form and change its default name to calculator, as shown in the figure. Next, click on the calculate button and enter the following code at the source code window, as shown in figure. Private subtotal 1, underscore, click. By VAL sender as system dot object, by VALE as system, event ARGS handles button 1. Click dim num1 num2 sum as single 
num1 is equal to 100 num2 is equal to 200 sum is equal to num1 plus num2 message box the sum of and num1 and 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 num2 and is and sum n sub the design window the code window run the project after you have finished writing the code you are ready to run the project use one of these three techniques one open the debug menu and choose start debugging two press the start debugging button on the toolbar three press f5 the shortcut key for the start debugging command the following window appears. Click the calculator button. The following output window appears on the screen. The output window. Working with controls. The Visual Basic 2008 Common Control Toolbox consists of all the controls essential for developing a Visual Basic 2008 application. Controls in VB2008 are useful tools that can be placed in the form to perform various tasks. They are used to create many kinds of Windows applications. The diagram given below is the toolbox that contains the controls of VB2008. They are categorized in common controls, containers, menus, toolbars, data, components, printings and dialogues. To insert a control into your form, you just need to drag the control and drop it into the form. You can reposition and resize it as you like. Let's examine a few programs that make use of button, label, text box, list box and picture box. 